Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today, this video is pretty exciting. I finally got my hands on the Women's 2020 Cruise Collection. It's actually called the Game On Collection. It's me almost like a Vegas gambling vibe. But let's get going. So I'm actually lucky. It actually doesn't launch until this week, the end of this week, I believe Friday. I was able to get my hands on it way before the launch. I still do have a few pieces coming in, but these are the first two pieces I received and I just really want to get it out there for you guys so people that are already like trying to plan what they want and stuff, they can really make a solid decision. Let's go. So of course I have the new bag that came with that collection. This is absolutely gorgeous. Look at this. Oh my god, the LV monogram, but it comes in like blue, black, um, red, like a maroon. So this is on the side of the bag. So this is also the holiday bag, I believe. So you're gonna go buy something this holiday season, probably up to like December, depending if they run out or not. You'll get one of these. So it's two-sided. So this side has the heart on one side. The other one is the clover. So this is really neat right here. And then the handles, which I really like. It's red and black. I ordered two pieces. This is how it came in. So this one, if you can guess, is the toiletry pouch. So let's open that first. Super excited. Oh my god, this is... Did you see that? I really like the toiletry pouch 26, except it has the, the heart, the LV monogram flower, and heart on this side again. Um, this is kind of like the signature logo that you're going to see throughout this whole collection. But there's nothing really different that I see on this bag. It actually wraps all the way around. Okay, so there's not a difference between this and, like I said, the regular monogram toiletry pouch. The interior is, the interior is like a tan lining. Okay, and this one was actually it retails um 675 in the U.S. before tax. And it is a coated canvas, so I would obviously be care anything with like color print on any Louis Vuitton pieces. I always am really careful with because color transfer or like. If you use it pretty often, it's gonna get dirty or it could honestly even chip. But that's just how, you know, anything is. So this one is the Toiletry Pouch 26. And let's move on to the next piece. Honestly, this is my favorite piece. Came in a small box. The card, the Blanc card holder. Let me do a close up. So this side is actually a Transform Epi Leather. As you can tell, the red hearts, it is made of epi leather. So this is actually my first epi leather piece, believe it or not. Even though I have like over almost 100 pieces of Louis Vuitton, I don't have anything in epi leather. And I honestly love epi leather. So this is pretty neat. I get, you know, like best of both worlds. So this one has only three slots. This one, two, and then there's a third one right here. And honestly, this is a really interesting card holder design compared to the regular card holders that Louis Vuitton makes. So the card holder is $430 US um, before tax. So it is a little bit more expensive than their standard card holders. I think it's just because of the epi leather that's on this. I really bought it just to collect it because this thing is so cool. It's literally like a playing card. I'm just gonna let you compare the sizes of these so you can tell. There isn't much of a size difference between all three of these, but these card holders, you know, in this style, definitely could hold a lot more. Even though they're, they're only three pockets, three slots just like this one. This one, honestly, I don't think it would hold much. Like, you can honestly put probably like several credit cards in the middle slot, but it's gonna stretch this out really, really bad, and it's gonna look so ugly afterwards. Like even these slots over here, I think you can only put one credit card max. They're pretty, they're pretty, they're, they feel loose, but I just, I don't like to stretch my items out. So this one, I would say only fits three credit cards max. I wouldn't even say you could put cash in here. Yeah, so you're thinking about this for everyday use, or not suggested at all. And if you're thinking between this one or a regular card holder like this, like this one, I definitely go with the this one just because it's a lot cheaper and it definitely holds a lot more. So this this one was about like two hundred twenty five dollars, I believe, if I'm correct. It's around that price range. This is almost double. Okay, so you're really paying for the Game On collection, which I'm a collector, so that's why I, I needed to have one of these pieces. I'm definitely probably never going to use this just because it's also white. Hey guys, thank you guys for watching again. Don't forget to subscribe because when you subscribe, it helps me make more of these videos. Don't forget to like, comment, share it. If you want to see anything else, have questions, feel free to drop them down in the comments below or you can always follow me on Instagram and shoot me a message there as well. Okay, see you next video. Bye guys.